I recommend that the, um, the candidate themselves find out as much about the company um, and the job that they're actually going to be doing. And a lot of candidates don't do the research specifically on the job or the role that they're expected to do. Most companies will actually give a full set of objectives and job scope um, and they, they give you vital clues in the interview what the sort of person is they're expecting. So actually understand the job role you're doing, understand a little bit about the business, where you're going to be working, how you're going to be working, what sort of role it is, is it a home based role, is it, working, is it working in an office environment. So understand what you're applying for, how you're doing it and understand a lot about the company's values and behaviours. A lot of the information is published on the internet and that gives candidates a great opportunity to understand the business that they're going to be working for and the company they're going to be working for. So therefore, they will have time to be able to do that research and go in there well prepared. I'd advise any candidate as a first step to go onto our website. Um, there's a whole host of information on there because one of the things that we would expect any candidate to know is some basic company information. We are, have a set of corporate values which are published on our website and again we look to assess those values through the interview process. So I would expect anybody to have at least gone onto our website. We strongly advise that candidates would research our organisation and get a feel either from the internet or from talking to people who may either be customers of E.ON or people who work for E.ON um, to understand what it is that makes us tick as an organisation, understand our, our business. Um, and also research engineering as a, as a broad concept and understand where your interest is in that field because it's important when you are applying for a role that you have some vision of where it may take you. And you can find all those things out by looking at our website. They, they need to prepare by going onto the company website, doing some research about the organisation, not because we want them to quote facts and figures about the organisation, but we want them to be absolutely clear about the opportunities that we have to offer. So certainly research, prepare for the day by, you know, if it's an interview, for instance, they're going for, make sure they've thought about some examples from their past, that they are that they're going to tell the complete story so they they explain it to us in a way that we're going to understand they don't use jargon um, they've planned their travel so that they don't leave things to the last minute they've planned what they're going to wear um, because all of that gives them confidence that you know they arrive in time they've got their suit or their smart clothing sorted out and they've thought through some of the examples of questions that we're going to ask